hello guys welcome to my channels and today i have come up with uh, some uh, you know interesting topics and i think it is familiar to everyone and we are uh, going to you know derive the quantity for any rcc works or any pcc works in a second in a very few times you know you know like very short period of times so <clears throat> like we have to you know in this video we are going to talk how to determine or how to derive the quantity of uh, cement sand aggregates in a very simple steps and uh, in a very short period of time so i have prepared one some one excel sheet and we put all the quantity you know in that particular area and we get it in a very short period of time so let's get into the excel sheet so this is my excel sheet so i have prepared this one and this is uh, you know so if you prepare such type of sheet then it will be very useful for you and to you know derive any certain quantity in a very <coughs> less time so suppose we have you know like pcc we need to cast a pcc for any particular area and we have 100 cubic meter like length breadth and depth we calculated and we want to know the And we want to know the number of uh, <coughs> bags of cement, sand, and aggregate. So it's very simple. And uh, if you know the you know formula in the concept, then it is very simple. So 100 cubic meter, we do it by 54 percent of you no know, weight quantity. So we'll get 154. I have the ratio 1 is to 3 is to 6, right? Sum of ratio is 10. And we have fraction part. We have divided that, you know, 154 divided by 10 and into 1. <coughs> so this is the fraction part. Like, uh, as you know the formula, like, you know, 154 divided by sum of this one so this will be this is the formula we have derived and i have you know kept in one column the fraction part and then i will divide i will multiply the fraction part with one so now i have to calculate the cement parts in a bags so here you can see the formula k15 k15 what's about this this model and 1440 is the density of the cement and i need to have you know bag so i have divided by 50 50 is nothing but uh, if you multiply with 40 40 then it will be in a kg and uh, and uh, kg and if you divide by 50 because one bag contains 50 kg so we will get into a number of bags so very simple simple from 444 bags we required for casting of 100 cubic meter for sand similarly this parts into this one we will get the sand in a cubic meter similarly this one this part into six will get aggregated cubic meter so for any bulk amount or any amount like we have pcc one is to two is to four for one uh, for one cubic meter we need seven bags of cement 0.44 cubic meter sand and 0.88 cubic meter of aggregates so if you you know <coughs> prepare such excel sheets and uh, and uh, we do the you know we understand the concept then it will not take much time to calculate the uh, you know the uh, quantity of cement sand aggregates bricks or any materials you want to calculate so this is suppose i have you know 75 cubic meter pcc similarly 54 percent will take 54 percent so we'll get like we have a weight bolo suppose we have any beam uh, length breadth and depth this is the weight quantity and this is this if you multiply with 54 percent plus 54 percent 0.54 then we'll get the dry volume then we have the ratio 1 is to 2 is to 4 and some ratio is 7 then this is i have uh, you know kept it as a fraction 16.54 means same formula like 1 1 15 divided by the sum ratio that will be this one and if you need cement then we'll this one into parts of cement is one so 447 similarly again 
fraction into parts of the sand and for aggregate parts of the multiply fraction into four at the parts of the ratio so you will get it so if you prepare such set then it will be easy for you to calculate of anything so similarly i have prepared for brick machinery right suppose i have a brick machinery of 50 cubic meter <coughs> so we will calculate by calculator and use 1 is to 4 ratio 5 fraction and 89 so you, you can prepare you know similar way so for brick machinery i will prepare you know i have here kept you know, one in coefficient because it's the concrete part 0 0.2305 is the you know mortar this is the mortar mortar and 1.33 percent so we take it for the you know to convert the wet volume into a dry volume so i will prepare one you know another videos to how to you know uh you know estimate the quantity of bricks and uh, you know amount of mortar and in a mortar we can prepare determine the cement sand aggregate so i'll prepare another video for on, on those topics and for inner plaster seen in everywhere in inner inner plaster on ceiling and outer and stone mason for everything we can prepare such sheet and we'll derive the quantity whatever we can so we'll, uh, i will make a video on uh, you know even uh, on these topics in the, in the coming days so till then please uh, you know watch this video and if you like please do share and subscribe and put your comments so i'll be you know very happy to make uh, <coughs> another videos and another in another interesting videos on civil engineering related topics so thanks for watching my videos i hope you liked so thank you very much